Learn this and you will save someone's life. Blood pouring out of a tracheostomy. So let's make this as easy as possible. Step one, call for help. You are probably going to need a surgeon, so let's get them involved as early as possible. Step two, hyperinflate the cuff. Add an extra 20 or 40 cc's of air into the cuff to try to get some direct pressure onto the bleeding site. Step three, reverse any coagulopathy. Step four, if the patient is still bleeding, we need to protect the lungs. So get a cuff deep to the level of the bleeding. Intubate. Make sure that if the patient is still bleeding, it's coming out of their mouth or the stoma instead of going into the lungs. And then step five, you're going to take your finger, you're going to insert it into the stoma and down into the chest and compress the innominate artery against the sternum and pinch like your patient's life depends upon it because it does. And you're not going to let go until the surgeon tells you it's okay.